TCC students, I'm so blessed that I can meet you again through this video because today we will go deeper to the words of God and we will listen to the good news. Let us pray. Let us start our Bible devotion with a prayer. Heavenly Father, thank you so much for today. Now we are ready to listen to your word. Please bless us, Lord. Guide us so we know what you want us to know, Lord. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. How many of you are strong? Can you show me your muscle? Wow, you are strong. I want you to show me just how strong you are. Here, I have a piece of paper. Can you use your muscle to rip this paper? Let's try it. Wow, it's easy for you. How if I give you 10 sheets of paper? Can you use your muscle to rip it? This is 10 papers. Hmm, some of you maybe can, other maybe cannot. How if I give you multiply sheets of paper here? Try and rip it. Can you do it? It's not easy, right? Now, I want you to think and mention heavy objects and strong objects. Oh, some of you say train is very strong. Yes, train is powerful. Some of you say boat is strong. Yes, boat is powerful. Oops, I listen someone say kitten is very strong. Do you think kitten is powerful? <laughs> no, kitten is not powerful. Today, I want you to meet a thing. This thing named coronavirus. It can make people fever, can make people sneezing, Achoo! Achoo! can make people coughing. <coughs> it makes people sick. And it even makes people die. Do you think this coronavirus is strong? Yes, it is strong and powerful. But now, I want you to think about God. From the Bible, we know God bring the sun up each day. God keeps the birds in the air. God can lift the heaviest mountains and move the biggest sea. God sees everything. God hears us when we pray. God let us breathe. And we also know that God can heal sick people. He even can raise Lazarus from the dead. So, who do you think more powerful, this coronavirus or God? I agree with you. God is more powerful than anything. He is more powerful than train, boat, or even coronavirus. God can heal people from coronavirus. Do you believe it? Now, I want to invite you and your family to pray together with me. Let us pray. God of love and hope, you made the world and care for all creation. But the world feels strange right now. The news is full of story about coronavirus. Some people are worried 
that they might get ill. Others are anxious for their family and friends. Be with them, Lord, and help them to find peace. We pray for the doctors and nurses and scientists and all who are working to discover the right medicines to help those who are ill. Thank you, Lord, that even in these anxious times, you are with us. Help us to put our trust in you and keep us safe. Amen. Remember this, God will bring health and heal to the people. He will let them enjoy peace and safety. It is written in the Bible, Jeremiah 33, verse 6. Please read together with your family and declare it for you, for your family, and for all of our nation. That is our Bible devotion today. Thank you and God bless you.